I started playing piano when I was really, really young. And so I guess what made me really want to be a musician was just admiring older people around me that influenced me to become better in listening to different varieties of music, including classical and jazz. Ever since I've been young, my dad's been playing, and I just picked it up from him, just ran in family. I want to be a singer because it's the easiest way for me to reach people and express how I'm feeling. My favorite genre is pop, fusion, a little jazz. Hip-hop, just because hip-hop can be anything. Um, my favorite genre should be uh, pop and R&B. My favorite genre of music is heavy metal. It's kind of hard, but I would say rock and roll. Uh, I have to say my favorite genre of music is rock. Um, the band Snarky Puppy inspired me to start writing music. I worked with Bob Lanzetti, the guitar player, and he taught me a lot, and I just started writing. I grew up listening to a variety of different genres, and they all inspired me. I'm, I see myself as an observer. I sing, I rap about the things that happen in my life and the lives of the people around me. Ever since I was like seven, I've just loved to like make jokes and put on skits. And when I realized that I actually could sing, it was just like adding to the fact that I love to perform. I think what makes me unique from other artists would be my concepts, my lyricism, and uh, my love for the my love for music. What makes me unique is I'm doing something that's outside of the norm and that what everybody else is not doing. Uh, I guess I'm unique because I incorporate a lot of different uh, styles into my music and I definitely have my own sound and I try not to be um, an imitator and be my own person, I guess. Uh, I think what makes me unique is the fact that I'm uh, so determined and I try to make everything a sort of an image of me whereas I try to twist everything using things that I like from other people and make it my own thing. I just try to, when I write songs, or when I'm singing, I just try to really put a lot of emotion behind it so I can reach the audience and they can know that they're not the only ones feeling a certain way. Um, well, when I've never had an experience like what they're singing about, it can be difficult, but I just try to like put myself in their situation or relate it to something similar to the, what, I've, what I've experienced. The biggest challenge is trying to not sound so much like the artist because when you listen to the artist sing it, you want to sound like them, but at the same time you also want to sound like yourself. So that's probably the hardest thing. The biggest challenge is trying to like switch up the words, making my own, but it's also making me feel creative along the way. I most definitely see myself doing this forever. Definitely. Um, I'll be doing this forever. I do see myself doing this forever because it's the only thing I really love. Yes, I do see it, but not only for me, but only for the ones that love music because not everybody got the opportunity to perform, you know, to share the time. Definitely see myself doing something in music forever, whether that be songwriting or performing or playing or whatever. I really hope I can do this forever. I love it so much and there's nothing better. Yes. I don't really see myself doing anything besides music. Do you see yourself doing this forever? don't see myself doing this for me.